the magic isn't it the magic isn't working on you and male wow this could be a male this could be another karmic masculine energy actually some male is trying to do magic over you or this could be someone trying to do magic over a male Someone don't realize some magic that they're, they're attempted is not working over you. Someone's trying to have you in like this constant state of confusion. That's what they're trying to do, confuse you or something. Yeah, there's magician reverse. That's the overall energy here. They don't want you to feel strong, empowered, confident. Spirits tell me you're getting out of their trap. Forming structure, solid foundation. Something could be balancing out for you too. They see you're solid. And it's like, it's like making them mad and making them want to do more magic. Yeah. Confusion reverse, Neptune energy, illusion reverse. You caught them. Somebody wants you to feel like this like watery feeling like in your eyes, like um, like glossy eyes or something like that. Deception, temptation, it's caught. reverse karmic they don't want to settle something or surrender or compromise or come to an agreement third party relationship lesson yeah it's a game to them or something it's like they're trying to play with your life think it's a, thinking it's a game or something They're about to find out that you are not confused. They're about to find something out. They're trying to affect something with your dreams too. Goddess of night and dreams. They could be doing this magic at nighttime. I'm getting a sense. They're, they're still thinking you could have changed. They're thinking you're still like the same person you used to be. You're still thinking how you used to be. They think this you're going to fall for this magic or something like that again, Spirit's telling me. Like at, at one point it was working on you. Something with your fate and wishes. Excuse me. They're nervous about something like that. 38, 40, 42, 50. There may be some kind of blockage of some sort and this energy is what I'm sensing. Could be communication blockages. They know you're focusing on something with your, with your fate, wish fulfillment. You could be going towards something fated or something fated is about to happen for you. You're solid, they see you're solid. Spirits telling me they know you're they know you're through for real is what I'm hearing. You're through for real. Wow. Gossip. They're afraid. Someone's afraid. Someone's extremely afraid, nervous. This person could have been talking about you, or this is someone you was talking to, um, gossiping with, caught gossiping or something like that. Um. Uh, 
Spirit's telling me cock, very cock walking. This is another karmic masculine energy. There was one that came out earlier today. Rejection. You could be rejecting this person who's doing magic. Either way, the magic is rejected. It got rejected. Abandoned, dismissed, irrational fear. They're in fear. Confusion, sorrow, past life. They're trying to keep doing stuff like they've been doing in the past. It's all about keeping you confused. This person may be a, a psychopath. I gotta get a sense like they got a psychopath mind. Split the deck, the tower, Knight of Cups. There's a tower coming through. The universe is not playing with whoever this is. Some of you guys are getting like spiritual upgrades or you're becoming more and more intuitive. You're becoming more emotionally mature. There's about to be a tower and then someone's about to take action with something with matters of emotions, love. Yeah, there's about to be a tower and then someone's about to do something that's going to lead to wish fulfillment and something with their fate. What I'm also seeing, whoever's doing this magic for some of y'all, they're trying to make sure you don't get a settlement or um, spirits tell me a beneficiary. They're trying to make sure you don't get a settlement or something. Some of y'all, they're trying to make sure you don't get some kind of inheritance or something like that. Oh, yeah. Split the deck. Ten of swords. There's about to be an ending. Wow. Judgment. Oh, yeah. This person is caught. All they're doing when they're doing magic is exposing themselves. I keep hearing that they're proof for real. Proof for real. Proof for real. Yeah, it's about to backfire. You survive something. Some of y'all they're doing they're doing coffin spells. They're they're doing um spells to yeah, y'all know what that is. Coffin grave spells. Ten of swords reversed. They see you survive some kind of magic. Some kind of magic was supposed to end you or something like that, or make you feel like you was about to be out of here or something. Ace of Wands reverse, yeah. It's not doing nothing. It's just backfiring. Five of Swords. This person is... Um, they could be doing magic over multiple people. Or you and someone else, possibly. Yeah. They're doing magic to get into your head and stuff. But you're not all up in your head like they are expecting. You're in the four of swords. You're you're thinking, contemplating, balance. Your mind is balanced, or you're trying to rest or rejuvenate. You could be doing some kind of healing or uh, just relaxing. Someone's thinking. You could also be having spirit or um, God helping you with something, giving you some kind of information for some of you guys if you guys are real intuitive. Yeah, someone was gossiping or talking about someone. There may be some kind of argument or getting ready to be some kind of argument or something like that. Ten of Wands. Someone's struggling, stressing. Struggling with some magic that's not working. Nine of Wands. Seven of Cups. This person sees you're guarded towards them. They're doing magic to hopefully have you confused and then stop being guarded towards them. Seven of Cups. It says something about this confusion. It 
Some of y'all, they're doing some kind of like stay with me spell work. Stay with me. Something like that. Spirit's telling me stay with me. Emperor reverse. Strength reverse. World reverse. Whoever this is, is a control freak. Could be narcissistic. This could be a male. This could be a masculine. Karmic masculine. Or someone abusive. This person could be abusive or abusing their power. With this world reverse, they're trying to make sure you don't end this cycle. You possibly don't even want this person in your life anymore or to be a part of your world anymore. This person's feeling very insecure or weak. This person may be jealous. Could be an Aries, Leo. of cups king of wands something's almost over somebody's been in this energy like you've been a fighter a soldier you've been having to fight through something for a long time it's something with your strength and resilience, your, your confidence. This may be a male trying to control another male for some of y'all. They're stressed out over some two of cups. Someone's about to take action. That's what they're, they're scared of, paranoid about. You are highly thought of both. Yeah, they're constantly thinking about you. They're unhappy. Happiness reversed and sunrise. New creative ideas, new ventures, a fresh start. They're unhappy about a fresh start or something new. Yeah, they're thinking about two people. Two people that have some kind of connection. Something about a sweetheart and fidelity. There may be a sweetheart in this energy or someone's being faithful to someone. Some y'all, they could be doing magic over your sweetheart. Someone sees you're not sad and that's like triggering them. Indecision reverse. Yeah, the magic is, this is all about something with decisions. Decisions are having you confused. This could be a Libra. They don't want you to know the truth about someone else or to pick someone else, partner with someone else, have an agreement with someone else. This could be about some kind of negotiations, contracts, commitments. This could be a love partnership or a business partnership they're trying to confuse you about. There's a sand clock here. Spirit tell me like they're feeling like they're running out of time. Venus and Aries. They see you've been focusing on yourself or something. It's almost been an independent energy focus on themselves, fearless, confident. You could be getting ready to take some kind of risk, possibly in love, or moon and Pisces, empathy, something that's hidden. You guys could be, some of y'all could be 
picking stuff up intuitively or hearing stuff with regards to some magic they're trying to do. Are you getting intuitive downloads? Something's about to end. They need to surrender whoever's trying to do magic over you because all it's doing is helping you move on. That's what they all realize. So yeah, something about an inheritance is here. Choice. Mars and Libra. They're trying to have you choose them or pick them. This could be something with the law. Whoever this is doing magic over you is trying to balance something out with you because they see you're about to balance something out in another area of your life. Or maybe with someone else. Inheritance, Scorpio energy. They're trying to stop something with an inheritance for some of you guys. Or manipulate something with an inheritance, some benefits. This could be something about other people's resources, taxes. you partnering up with someone else something like that some kind of partnership disturbance obscure irritation supernatural and nightmare this person is irritated they're doing stuff behind the scenes like magic they're in the nine of swords darkness suffering stress persecution sleepless nights anxiety they have anxiety Relaxation reverse, triumph, and wish, hope, worship, vow, victory, success, achievement. They're stressing because they know you're going to have this fulfillment, this wish fulfillment, this fate. You're hopeful for something. You're triumphing or winning. They know you're going to get something or someone's going to get something from you or some kind of partnership is going to work out for y'all. See this disturbance energy obscure irritation supernatural yeah that's that's the person doing magic over you magic's not working page of cups reverse it's some kind of magic with your emotions energy you may be feeling um sad or you may be set to that but that's not your energy that's them they're just trying to send that to you to confuse you the sun reverse. Yeah, there's some kind of sadness here. The moon reverse. Wow. Yeah. They think it's hidden, but it's not. What they're doing in the dark is not hidden. Someone's about to have some kind of emotional outburst or something like that in their future. Yeah, because your happiness, something with your happiness, nine of cups, something with your happiness or something new, blessings, a fresh start. You being solid. I'm tired of denying my feelings for you. Someone could be denying their feelings in this energy. When you love yourself, you glow differently. Your bank account is full and your happiness, your own happiness is what fills your cup. So you're in a self-loving energy. That's what's got this person um, sad. Someone's trying to do magic over you. Resentful, someone's resentful. You could be becoming resentful towards whoever this is because I keep doing this magic, it looks like. Someone's afraid to confront you. There's going to be a confrontation or something. They sent them messages from a fake phone number. Someone is about to be left behind. Wealthy man or wealthy woman. 
spell work and something with the fall. Yeah, they're doing spell work. They're doing all kinds of stuff. It's like they're doing any little thing so you don't close out a cycle. 